Hey guys, um, so I am doing day eight of Jelly October, or Inktober, sorry, Inktober. And I decided to break away from the small cards that I was doing and get out the round jelly plate that I have. Um, this one's actually pretty brand new. I've had it for quite a while and I've never really used it. But if you look, it fits a six inch stencil from the Crafters Workshop quite well. And I'm using my uh, TCW 899, that's the Striped Mandela. And I'm also using the Circle Orb one. And I don't have the number on me, but I promise I'll include it down below on my description, in the description box, sorry. <clears throat> sorry, allergies are so bad out here. The fall with leaves falling down. And my husband decided to go out there with the leaf blower and blow the leaves, which really just got me going crazy. Um, let's see. So I am using some fluid acrylics by Golden. I'm using Indian yellow, um, and green gold, and then, uh, or, uh, orange red oxide, whatever that is, orange oxide. I always forget that color. Let me look it up. It is quinidrone burn orange, actually. It's not the orange oxide. So I'm sorry. I was incorrect. And I like using the flu fluid acrylics or the acrylic inks on my uh, gel press plate because it actually dries a lot quicker than using just regular acrylic paints. Now you can use any kind of paints, but I find the cheaper the cheap acrylic paints or the fluid acrylics work the best. Um, let's see. So I am my theme for today is flowers or mandelas. So I use two Mandela stencils, and then after I'm done with all of this, I'm going to cut the circles out. And they're going to be pretty sloppy, wonky circles because I'm just cutting around what I printed out. And I am going to go ahead and doodle a flower on each one of these on one side. And the other side, I'll keep the stenciled image on. So I will definitely be using inks for the Jelly Inktober or for Inktober and um, then I'm mixing it with acrylics. But I thought I'd go easy on myself today because uh, I'm a little tired. So anyhow, I'm gonna be quiet, let you listen to the music, and I'll try to put in uh, de in the description box all the products that I used. Again, if you have any questions, let me know. I was also gonna let you know, for those of you that listen to the voiceover, um, if you put the hashtag in there, hashtag Sparks Girl Mixed Media, it's in the bottom where I put my hashtags, I'll definitely see what you do. I do look in the Jelly Inktober, but it's not so sure that I can see that you're copying what I do or you're trying to emulate it. So if you don't tag me, at least put that hashtag in there. Again, that's hashtag Sparks Girl Mixed Media. Once you save it, you can, it'll autofill pretty easy. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Again, I hope you're having a great day, and it's almost the weekend, so woohoo! Take care. I'll talk to you later. Bye.